Now is the right time to show how to work with sheets, specifically with the sheet tabs. To access the sheet manipulation options, right click on the bottom tab. A pop up menu will appear and you will select specific options here. We will show some useful ones. The first option is the insert option. This option is used to create a new sheet. In this dialog box, the sheet is selected. You confirm by selecting OK and the sheet is now created. It will be placed in front of the sheet we were standing on. Another option, I think even faster, is to use this little plus icon and another sheet will also be created. If you would like a keyboard shortcut, you can use Shift plus F11. We may notice that the sheets are automatically numbered. This is because sheets cannot have a name that has already been used. Of course, in practice, it's better to name the sheets according to your needs, so that we are familiar with them and it's also not difficult to rename the sheet. Click on the sheet with the right mouse button, select the rename option or double click on the sheet name with the left mouse button, which activates the field for the name and here we can rename the sheet as we like. Finally, confirm with the enter key. If you would like to remove the sheet, right click on it and select delete option. Caution, deleting sheets cannot be undone. If we want to change the order of the sheets, the easiest way is to grab the sheet with the left mouse and drag, move it to another position. If there were more sheets, the right mouse may be easier and there is an option to move or copy. We choose the sheet before which we want to move it and confirm the choice by OK. You may have noticed that in the same move or copy menu, you can also select the workbook to which you want to move this sheet. This is also possible, as well as it's possible to make a copy here by checking this option to create a copy. Again, you may notice you can't use the same name more than once. It now has the number 2 in the brackets at the end. The easiest way to copy sheets within a single workbook is to grab this tab and hold down the control key as you drag. As soon as you release the mouse, you also release control and the copy is created again. We can also recolor the individual tabs of the sheets in the right mouse the tab color option and choose your color. It may seem like this. If the sheet contains some auxiliary calculations and we would like to hide it, we also have the option to hide it in the right mouse. Such a hidden sheet can then be displayed again with the right mouse on any tab and select the unhide option. A list of hidden sheets will appear we will select the hidden sheet, confirm it by selecting OK and it will be displayed again. If there were more sheets in the workbook that we can see here, we can even scroll through them with these arrows. Or the list of the sheets can even be called up with the right mouse at this point and we can select the one we want to see. This is especially useful when there are really a lot of sheets. We would find similar options as in the right mouse on the Home tab and here in the Format option, it's hidden in these options. Rename sheet, Move or Copy sheet, Tab color and Hide and Unhide sheet. And I think the fastest options are really in the right mouse down here, so most people use it. If you have made as many copies as I, you can try to delete them again. Thanks for watching, give a like, subscribe and see you in the next lesson.